Don't be afraid of the dark. Written by Ruskin Bond. Don't be afraid of the dark, little one. The earth must rest when the day is done. The sun must be harsh, but moonlight never. And those stars will be shining forever and ever. Be friends with the night. There is nothing to fear. Just let your thoughts travel to friends far and near. By day, it does seem that our troubles won't cease. But at night, late at night, the world is at peace. The world is at peace. Wow, such a beautiful poem. So dear kids, never be afraid of darkness because there must be a ray of light to give you lots of happiness. Let's learn some new words from the poem and know their meanings too. Our first word is afraid. Afraid means feeling fear. I'm afraid of dark scary nights. Harsh. Harsh means rough or being cruel. We should not be harsh with animals. Trouble. Trouble means difficulty. Rat got into trouble while stealing the cheese. Seize. To come to an end. The boy should cease beating his brother. This is really wrong to beat someone, isn't it? Come on, let's find out the answers of some questions from the poem. What is the poem about? The poem is about how to not get afraid of the darkness. What happens when the day is over? Night comes when the day is over. What does the earth do when the day is over? The earth takes rest when the day is over. What does the poet want us to do at night? The poet wants us to think about our friends at night. Dear friends, do you know what are compound words? Come, let's know what are these words. Compound words are formed when two or more words are joined together to create a new word that has an entirely new meaning. Like moonlight. It is formed by moon and light. Good night. Waterfall. Breakfast. Daybreak. And rainbow. All these are examples of some compound words. Now, it's time to find out some opposite words from the poem. So kids, our first word from the poem is light. The opposite will be 
dark war peace enemies friends night day gentle harsh start cease do you know what are contractions actually contractions are words that has been shortened by dropping one or more letters and an apostrophe is used to indicate the place of the missing letters we can call it short form of the words some examples are didn't full form will be did not doesn't it means does not don't do not can't cannot what's what is let's the full form will be let us shouldn't should not couldn't could not so these are some of the examples of contractions for more videos please like share and subscribe padte kadam